Well, we'll get to that in just a moment, but let's just start with the basics here. She did file this complaint uh, with the USDA after she says she found something that should not have been in her fish fillet sandwich. I thought it was disgusting. It was gross and it was a parasite of some sort. Jerrica Kleiss of Southgate noticed something fishy about her McDonald's fillet of fish after the first bite. Go well, back with the next bite and see something hanging out of the fish sandwich, which to me looked like a little worm. The fillet of fish frozen for safekeeping and future testing. You can see something brown between the breading. Jerrica says she immediately took the sandwich back to the store. They offered to make me a fresh sandwich. Jerrica refused the offer and notified the USDA, which, according to this letter, has forwarded her complaint to the Wayne County Health Department. The owner of the restaurant is also responding, telling 7 Action News, food safety and quality are a top priority in our restaurants. We take this matter seriously and are currently investigating the nature and origin of this claim. I just want people to be aware, you know, to watch what they're eating, and that was my concern. Well, in the last few minutes, we received another statement from the owner of that restaurant through his public relations firm. It says, quote, food safety and quality are a top priority in our restaurants. A complaint was received by the Wayne County Department of Health on January 3rd. That same day, the department conducted a thorough inspection at the restaurant and found no violations relating to that complaint. Now, Jerrica says she bought the sandwich here at the McDonald's in the 16,000 block of 4th Street on December 28th. At about 9 o'clock tonight, she hopes to have someone else look at that sandwich to determine whether or not her claims are true. We're live in Southgate tonight. 7 Action News, Curtis Jackson.